again, and we are going to figure out where these spiders are, because they were definitely part of another spawner system. And they definitely sound above me. Now they sound to my left, for sure. Left? Man, I need to get my directions right. Where are these guys? Oh, I had to ask. I asked and got my answer. Oh, there's their spawner. I don't know why I'm not getting poisoned by these guys, though. It's really weird. No, 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 no. No creeper. No. Whew. I don't care if he blows up and takes out part of my face. I just didn't want him destroying the spawner. Okay. We have now conquered our second baby spider spawner. Cave spider. It's technically not baby spiders. It's cave spiders. Still no idea why I'm not being poisoned. This is not a modified server. I am using the official server. So, I don't know. Maybe maybe it was a bug with the official server after... Because this is the initial, like, immediately after release server for 1.2.5, I think we're on. It's kind of sad that I don't even know what we're on. Oh, I hate water so much. Water, go away. Okay, now... Got those two spawners. Probably... Is there another one above me? Or is that just spiders that spawned up there? going on down here? Hey, hey. Oh, wow. Uh. <laughs> um, yeah. Drowned? How do you drown? I, I mean, come on. I didn't drown once the entire time I was building this place. I don't even understand. Oh, that's not good. Flint, go away. We need rail more than we need flint. I don't know. Whatever. I don't think he watches my videos. Maybe he does. Then he'll get to hear me make fun of him for drowning. Whoa. Hey there. Where... Oh, there you guys are. Fix that. Make sure they don't spawn on this side anymore. I'm getting distracted by rail. Which means I'm going to eventually end up losing track of where these spider spawners are. And once again, I am out of torches. Oop. Now, there's a high probability that... What I plan to... You slime? How do I get to you? Oh, seriously, how do I get to you? I think I killed it. Oh, slime balls. Goodbye, Lapi Lazuli. I will not miss you. Ooh. Okay, here's the spider spawner. And... Oh. Hey there. 
Now, if I'm right, the other one should be... Right... Okay, yeah, it's right here. Now... Let's see. One, or two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one... 22, 23, 24. Fuck. I hate to say it, guys, but I do not think they're close enough to make a double spawner setup. But actually, I'm retarded. I believe it to be within 16 blocks. Which these might be, when you factor in the distance over, somewhere in the area of. Wild guesstimate here, but I'm going to say probably somewhere in the area of about 26 or so. So it's going to be very, very... Uh, I don't know what the word is for what I was about to say there. It's going to be very close. But it might be possible. Um, I want to see what happens if I try and build a, a stairway to the surface right here. Apparently I get gravel thrown on my head. Well, not on my head. He tried. But, uh... I really want an easy access way here. If I come up under the ocean, it won't be a complete loss. Um... I will want some kind of... something. I'm just gonna do this to block any water that might come down should I have a flooding issue. Um, hmm. Go away, Flint. Oh. Oh. Well, too late. Uh, you know, I got these chests. Let's make use of them. Slime ball, diamonds. I'll keep the bread on me. Redstone, bones. Bone seeds, gold, mushrooms, pretty much anything I want to keep track of, I think. Uh, that'll be good enough for now. Stop using this guy for the moment. Yeah, I know I put the uh, stone in there for three of them. Well, I had been needing stone to make stone brick, so I guess this is uh, one way to go about it. However, this is going to take a while. So, I'll be back with you guys whenever I either reach the surface or run into something interesting. Hey guys, we're back. And we reached the surface. We're being attacked by a zombie straight off. Um, as you can see over there's the little place, and you see the whole way down there. I don't know if I could easily make it there, but um, the ability to come over here and have access to the stuff is always handy. But uh, I'm going to mark this up like so. And I'm probably going to put some kind of design or something here and flesh out the entire area down there and whatnot. But I wasn't going to do that with stone picks. But, uh... We are here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the uh, the house over there. Uh, I didn't bring my iron with me, but I got plenty of iron over there. I'm going to make some buckets. And I'm going to work on... Well, I'm going to need to get trees and stuff, and i got a lot of stuff that I need to do, basically, to get prepared for this. And here's a boat. There's another one floating around over there. But, uh, I haven't made an easy way down here, but I want to show you guys home. I, I don't know if you just heard that, but, uh, I got some cows. And I wanted to make sure they couldn't get out, so they are in a box, buried in the ground with a three thick door like uh, just to give you an example 
Yeah. The roof is like five high as well. I, I did not want to lose these cows. They're quite possibly the only cows in the area. And I'm going to need the rail track for them. Rail track? Railroad track for them. Um, I need to find... There, there has to be a surface exit to this cave, because it is... There is one somewhere. Maybe there's one right here. Oh. Oh. Well, there we go. That's more or less what I was looking for. Kind of. Um, but I want to make... Just rearranging myself in my seat there. But I want to get those cows down here and have like a farm or something. Like maybe I'll go off that way. No, I can't really go off that way. There's land there. Um, but, you know, I can like extend in any direction for any of these. So like I can go off there and make a pod or room or whatever you want to call it. And, you know, I can put the portal there like I wanted to. And I can go off this way and I can make a big room and I can make animal pens and whatnot. Get some sheep down here and stuff. But uh, that's pretty much my plans for that. Algernon's having his good old time just sitting there. But uh, I'm going to get back to work on... Well, I'm going to... I'm going to make the spider things at some point. But I'm going to clear the whole thing out. whole area I want to work with around them. So that way... Uh, but I'm not going to build anything. I'm just going to clear out the room, get everything all good to go and whatnot, and uh, then I will show you guys how I plan to do that. But uh, that'll be the next episode. This is it for this one, and I will see you guys later. Okay, guys. I uh, I didn't hollow the whole thing out like I made it sound like I was going to do. Um, I'll show you my plan. Let me just safeify this a bit this whole area pretty much uh, anything outside these little channels which I don't exactly know for sure that what I plan to do with this one is going to work um, but I will show you that here in a second I believe I left myself an opening up top. I hope so. I'd be very disappointed with myself if I didn't. But, uh... I'm obviously going to have to get all these resources out of here. I don't know, maybe I'll just leave them there. But, uh, here's the one room. And I was going to try putting a double sign set up here in the middle. So, it's, like, by itself. And then I would fill the entire outside of the room with water. Like pretty much kind of like this um, so then you'd get like water from over here pushing in and it all from all the different sides should in theory push directly into the middle which I'd do is I'd stack a sign on top of a sign against the wall there so the middle's empty and it should hopefully push the spiders down in I don't know if that's gonna work um, I am going to test it and each of these rooms are... Oh, I missed some of the wood. I've been trying to chop out the wood so I could keep it. But, uh... These rooms are... Three on each side. So I guess they're seven by seven, and then they're five high. With the, uh, spawner directly in the center. That's that one. I'll go to the other one. Um, I have pretty much the same setup for it. Ooh. I... Maybe... Okay, I'm going to just place in temporary steps. Now, you'll see this room is going to be designed more like a normal one. It's the same exact... It will be the same exact size uh, as it currently stands. It's apparently not, because right there is where the spawner is. You see three. And then this one, I guess, will go four. But that was just because of... Uh, I had to change it because of how far the water will travel. Um, but then each of these sides will be expanded out one. None of this wood will be here. Uh, the wood will be turned... I'm collecting the wood because I use it. And I'm replacing it with cobblestone where appropriate. And maybe I'll use these. I'm going to need to make some iron bars. Uh, you'll see why with that when I get there. But, uh... 
I don't have any of those materials on me. I was trying to give you an idea of what I was going to do with this. I'll probably fill in the water, and then I will show you the rest of it when I get there. But uh, I'll be back with you when I'm prepared for that. Hey guys, I just uh, just got, got done going out and finding some trees, which I luckily found birch trees and I got some birch saplings and there's a whole forest and everything over here, pigs and cows and I'm just gonna leave them alone for now. I'm gonna make sure I get all these saplings that have dropped and I'm gonna run back so you guys can see how far I had to go to find it. It's actually pretty impressive, which there's also a uh, village over there. So, all around me, I've got a forest biome, a plains biome, a desert biome, I'm in an ocean biome that has an abandoned mine shaft, a double cave spider spawner, there's a village, I mean, I'm pretty sure I found the most perfect area I could have ever chose to build my underwater base, and I'm pretty sure I had seen a swamp way off that direction, maybe, um, I forget exactly where it was, but it was somewhere. Can see my cows that are in the ground because apparently hey now stupid glitchy terrain don't kill my cows but uh, I dug up right here put a little staircase because I'll be able to run rails down this which it goes down around through here and I'll be able to easily get the cows down here now um, but I went out and collected the wood because the little drop system, I th believe it still works. Uh, of course, so I've never actually built a drop system like what I've been doing um, ever before, so I've never really... The the only the closest thing I've seen to a, a built to a drop system is what you saw in my Season 1 Let's Play with my mob spawner darkroom box with the, uh, the droppy thing. Droppy thing. Um, but, uh, I didn't bring the iron gates I was talking about. I'll probably try putting a regular fence and see if that works, but I think it does cause issues. Um, but what we've got here is, it goes up, and the top of that is 24 from where they would land right there when they get dropped. So, um, what I was doing is apparently leaving my buckets back at the house like an idiot. Well, shit. Okay. I will be back. Alright, I am coming back from my house with the buckets, as I'm sure you can see. Now, I want to make sure this bucket is full, and this whole thing is so confusing to navigate now, because I had some technical difficulties. Made some bread while I was gone, made some signs, so I need the signs. I will show you why we need the signs. Did some uh, farming, that's why the hoe was in a uh, lack of food scenario. Now, place a sign there. I believe this works. I hope so, otherwise I'm retarded and just wasted a bunch of time. Sign. Water. Which... I'm already having difficulties. How do I get out of here? Well, that's not the, quite the way I'd originally planned to get out of that, but uh, I suppose it works. My workbench keeps on lighting on fire, which is kind of interesting. But, uh, I'm not going to have anywhere near the water I need to do this whole thing. To be honest, I'm not overly concerned about it. My only concern is getting back down after I'm done. Which, if I don't have a bucket of water, I might have to do this two buckets at a time just so I can, uh go down. You know what I mean. Apparently there's rail over there. There's my chest. 
I should have brought well ladders wouldn't have gotten me real far either. Well, they would have, but they wouldn't have. Hmm. Oh, derp. What a better way to get down from. Well, damn. I'm gonna need to make stone shovel. But uh, as I was saying, what a better way to get down from anything than using gravel. Sand works too, but I didn't leave myself any sand, so... That, it's not really a possible option. As you can tell, spiders. Lots of spiders. How many spiders? Oh, shit. Forgot I'm not going to be able to open that. Um, well, I guess it's going to have to wait. There's a lot of spiders. So many spiders that last time it started lagging me up before I was done building. I had to leave for a little while. That's part of the reason why I did farming. Well, that was actually after that segment, but that's not the point here. Point is, gravel. No, no, that's not the point. But uh, still, gravel should actually be more than enough gravel. Well, probably not. There's a very good chance I will lose gravel on the way down each time. Which, speaking of which, losing gravel on the way down each time. I've already got to lose some gravel because I went up too early. Go. I need water. Water, water, water. You know, realistically, while I was up there like that, I should have. Oops. I should have used that bucket of water. Oh, iron. And if you haven't been able to tell, I'm still just cutting through my diamond because I apparently just don't care. I should care. Not sure why I don't. There we go. You know, realistically, I could probably just make like an infinite spring somewhere, but that's almost... The, the, not even almost, just like not even worth the effort required for it. That sounded kind of nifty. The sound of the uh, torch falling. I don't know if this, I'm assuming it doesn't need to be glass, because if it does, I'm in a serious problem. Considering I don't really have any good way down at the moment, I'm already in a bit of a serious problem, but, uh... There was more gravel up there, I saw it. And it was all around me. I got five signs left, but only three buckets. Listen to all those spiders. This is ridiculous, isn't it? I think it's ridiculous. Okay, back to building. The thing is, I can use that gravel to get up, and as long as I go up through that little chamber, it will work very well for going back down. Because it's gravel I won't have to place again. Two signs, so one, one there, and one there, and then there will be water there. We won't really need the top level, but now well, I guess we won't need it. Besides, I think it's 24 high up there. Ooh. I think that's uh, 24. We don't want to drop them 24 because 24 should. 
theoretically kill them. Which is not what we are after. But uh, I have more than enough gravel. So that's always a good sign. Stop burning, workbench. Now this should be our last trip up. Hopefully this works as I had intended. Now I had 31 before I started this, but I don't know how close to the bottom I was. I haven't even used 15 yet though, so hopefully I wasn't too close. Both of these signs, one there, water, oh, oh, okay, gonna have a slight difficulty here apparently, sign there, water, oh, well not water quite yet there, well crap, I need another sign. This is something I should have, you know, figured out before I came up. You sign right there. Build that back in. Water goes there. And then the spider should fall down through this hole, which I still need to finish the bottom part of it. For example, right here. So we need this whole thing to be encased because we don't want them sneaking out of it either. Which, this unfortunately, also means that uh, I have more and more pathways that are in the way. Can I get through here? And this path does go the whole way around. So I think the big issue right now is getting down here. It's now solved. Let's fill this in for the measure. Okay, spiders should come down through here. Man, they are loud. Uh, making it easier to get through here. Now, taking this bucket of water for some unknown reason. Because, why not? Oh, we're good. I want to see what happens if I use a wooden fence for this purpose. Probably won't work. At least not the way I have intended. I'm gonna put a fence here too. And here. Now I'll be able to hit up through there. Hopefully they won't be able to escape through this tiny hole. Oh yes they will. I can jump through it. They can escape through it. You're probably wondering what exactly I'm doing now. I was freeing the spiders. Unfortunately, I won't know if this is working unless they come falling down. So, I guess I'll just have to sit here and wait and hope they come falling down. It's not exactly the way I originally planned to handle this, but no. I don't have any glass with me. The spider sounds, they're all around me. 
I don't know how long it's gonna take him to go up that high if it is working. That's why there's just an all-around problem with this whole thing. Could theoretically try to get up to the top and cut that open and see if the spiders are up there, but I just don't think it's worth it. I could always put glass through here. I don't think I have any sand. Neither with me. Oh, there is some sand in here. Or cobble in there, too. I know there's coal somewhere around here on the floor. God, I hope you guys can hear me over these spiders. Let me just turn them down. God, that is a lot better. Oh. I heard a falling noise. Did he die? You know, I have no idea what just happened. They're probably clogging up and not letting each other go up the, uh, spout. Oh, on the way I have this set up, there's no easy way to remedy things that go wrong. Lovely. Did I break something here? Something's definitely wrong. Oh, oh, stop it. I think they're getting clogged on each other for one thing, which I don't really know what to do about that. I'm gonna do something really stupid though. Pull this water out of here so I can see what's going on. Okay. Ow. Oh, oh. That's what was wrong. Okay, um, shit, my armor's about broken, and I lost this song. balls, oh, I already got some sticks, okay, Off, oh, alone. Hell. Stop. Whoo. Yeah, my armor's about shot. My boots are gone, my helmet's gone. So, this is dangerous. I'm not going to lie. Now, water here. And now, hopefully, it's working. I doubt it, though. Oh, there was string there. Oh, there's more string up there. Spiders, do me a favor. Fall down. Okay. Now, 
I never did figure out the exact point at which both spawners are activated, though. But... This is kind of working. Fighters? I still think they're getting clogged up, but I'm not entirely sure what I can do about that. I can send them into the same channel, but it's going to take some serious effort to accomplish. Which I'm cracking my knuckles, if you can hear that. But sending them into the same channel is definitely something I'd want to do around the other side. That's... I already played with that. That's not going to get me very far. I'm going to do this, just so that way if they do survive, they're not just going to appear and eat me. Now... i got to figure out where exactly each of these water channels are. Okay... Water channel are you? I'm not even seeing any spiders coming out of this one. Spiders. Hello. Spiders. Ow. Now, stop hitting me as you go past. Cheeky git. Okay. I'm gonna see how far I can get this water to go. I want it from here. No? Why is the water pouring out of here now? Stop it. Oh. Oh. That's bad. Kind of. W <laughs> It's not quite what I meant to do. That explains part of the spider problem. Now if I can swim up this, so can they. So that's good. However, now the primary problem is getting them to there. From there. Stop it! I know you're probably not happy with your current accommodations, but that's no reason to attack me. Lock that up. Okay. Temporary block on that. Here, temporary block on that, and then the both of them should meet up and go this way, in theory. Now, I don't know whether the spiders will actually decide to climb that. That's one thing I don't know. Oh. 
power. I think if I use some water here, here, I can actually cause the water to arc up the end of it. Which, yeah, that should hopefully cause them to swim that way. I've got an experience bowl attacking my face. Where is this other torch? There it is. Okay. Now, I've been recording for a good long while. Um, I'm gonna see how much stuff has appeared down here. Not a whole lot sitting here, but... I'm gonna leave you guys... Well, I wanna see if Spider comes down now. Although, I have a feeling I've created some kind of a kink or something somewhere that's clogging them up. But I can't really tell, because I have no way to access either one of these spawners at this point. But, uh, I'm gonna call this good for now. I'm gonna head over here away from the spiders, and I will see you guys next time.